So a lot of people have been asking about the parfait recipe that we showed in the last video, and that is what today's video is going to be about. For me, it's super exciting that somebody actually came up with a better way to deliver sea moss to us because the old way was just, it was just really gross to me. I didn't really like working with it. It looks like a dirty goo. I mean, it, compared to this one, I mean, it's just so much more creamier. It just makes whatever I put it in, it just makes it so much more satiny. I saw a dessert a couple weeks ago. It was like a uh, creme brulee, but the real one. And I was noticing the texture. And I'm like, yeah, of course you could get that texture. You're dealing with dairy, eggs, cooking, you know, but let's try and copy that with raw food. But I'm telling you, with this new sea moss, you can actually achieve that satiny, real like consistency that people get with uh, eggs and milk. And like you can even cube it. It's cubed so nicely, just like jello. And, you know, I don't know if we talked about it in the last video, but this is like one of the most highest mineral foods out there. It's got something like 89 out of 102 minerals that you cannot get in a regular diet. You can't get that eating regular food. And another super cool benefit of sea moss is it is so satiating. People eat too much. Two tablespoons of sea moss, you're not going to want to eat for the rest of the day. So if you're trying to lose weight, throw sea moss into your diet. And in my opinion, one of the most important benefits of the moss is its ability to form collagen. And let's take vanity away because a lot of people are consuming uh, the moss for hair, skin, and nails, but it goes deeper than that. It holds in the arteries and the heart, and collagen is so important for all that inside of us and without it, everything falls apart. So, so important for things that we can't see what's going on. So let's bring it right back up to the surface now and do vanity again. Uh, a lot of people have been writing, Marcus, saying how the hair has never been longer and more lustrous and skin and nails. And I am one of those people. My hair, skin and nails have never looked better ever. I, I, I ignored my nails. My hair, it has never been so thick in all my 54 years. And I've never had it this long. So this is another really good reason to incorporate two tablespoons in your diet every day. Don't buy the gel, you're paying for glass and water. Whereas something as light as this, it makes seven pounds of, of gel. This is a really delicious recipe, the way I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's just get started really quick. Super easy, super easy and quick. Um, okay, so to the blender, we have a cup and a half of cashews. You can soak them if you want. Um, a lot of people soak their nuts to make the consistency much smoother, but because of this, this new and improved Irish moss, you don't need that for some reason. It just does it itself. So I do, this is a little hair over a tablespoon, this ice cream scooper. So I'm gonna do a tablespoon of coconut butter, the tablespoon to a tablespoon and a half of maple syrup. It's all you need. So this makes two servings. So basically if you use a tablespoon, you're only getting a half a tablespoon or, you know, using a tablespoon and a half, you're getting three, four. So it's not that much. Also, if you want it a little sweeter, you can um, candy your nuts. So I candied mine with Marcus sugar. I blend it, uh, I powderize it, make it into a powder and with a little water and throw it in the dehydrator for 24 hours. Okay, now to the Irish moss. Four tablespoons of Irish moss in there and you will not even taste anything but dessert. No fishy flavor whatsoever. Splash of vanilla and about a cup of water. Okay, let's look at this texture. Oh, it is so creamy. It's like pudding. Okay, so I'm gonna grab my little glass and we're gonna start the layering process. 
Now, there's no rhyme or reason for these layers. You could do it in any order you want. I'm starting with some candied almonds and strawberries. Get some blueberries in here. I mean, the candied nuts are just, oh God, you need something crunchy in there. So the candied nuts are just amazing. I highly suggest a loving gesture toward the one you love. Make one of these and have it waiting in the refrigerator when they get home and say, oh, there's something in the refrigerator with your name on it. Maybe put a sticky note. Now tell me, if you went into the refrigerator and opened it and saw one of these waiting for you, you would be tickled pink and be like, oh, they love me. <laughs> and it's so healthy. So yeah, they really do love you. Now, I know you're gonna wanna eat it right away, but refrain, put it in the fridge for an hour. It's best enjoyed chilled. Great way to get Irish moss in you every day. Mmm, delicious. Okay, guys, thanks for joining me, and we'll see you in the next video. I got a few more birds. <laughs> Bye.